Today we're going to be going over the Israel-Hamas war, and uh, why, I hate to break it to you, not a genocide. But if you do like the video, hit the like, comment, subscribe button, hit the bell notification on. We go over music, politics, and culture, I try to make up uploads every single day. But alright, let's get into the video. Peace. To the CIA, the Central Intelligence Agency, the population growth rate of all recognized territories. Gaza ranks 41st. And look, I'm sorry, when you rank in the top 75% of all countries in birth rates and population growth rate, I'm sorry, that's literally not a genocide at all. You could have people maybe acting with genocidal intent, but we'll, we'll debunk that right now, too. But, uh, like, th there's no way this could, you know, like, oh, this is genocide. While well, we're the 41st highest population growth rate in the entire world. Get out of here. So. Basically, the definition that we're given for Article 2 is... In the present convention, genocide means any of the following acts committed with intent to destroy a whole or in part a national, ethnic, racial, or religious group as such. Meaning, they have to say explicitly, meaning if Israel says explicitly, we are going to mop the floor with Palestinians, we don't care if they're guilty or innocent, they are just filth scum. And we're gonna kill them all, and then they start bombing them indiscriminately. Stuff like that's a genocide, right? You can take that to the ICJ. What's happening now is not genocide. It's just Hamas did this horrible thing, which, by the way, anyone outside of fucking idiots would tell you it's a it's not a good it's not a bad thing. It's absolutely horrible what they did. Israel is just responding as such, and be and Hamas are acting like absolute pussies. And saying, genocide, genocide, oh no. Yeah, get out of here. Yeah, no, I'm sorry, it's it's not a genocide. Anyone who says that, are, are, you know, those types of people, I think sometimes natural selection just needs to take its place. I, I, I could probably leverage that the people who deep fry hair ties and eat them as a trend in South Korea, which by the way is real, it, it I probably have a little more intelligence than those people, but yeah, uh, so I mean, look, it's not genocide. Now, there are things you can criticize Israel of, which are absolutely true. Like the white phosphorus bombings in 09 and uh, 2010, roughly. I think between 08 and uh, 2010, roughly. I, I have to relook up that information. But I know for a fact there was white phosphorus bombings in uh, civilian centers, which is not allowed. Like, that's, you know what I mean? And I think Israel even recognized that they did that, and it was probably not allowed, so they, so they disarmed it. But still, the fact it happened, right? But, uh... Yeah, so, I mean, again, there's things you can criticize them about, but genocide is the dumbest fucking imaginable argument you can make. You know, but a lot a lot of these people are just dumb and dumber, so they'll, they'll just continue to follow dumber, because they're dumb. So. Yeah, no, I'm sorry. It's it's not a genocide. Anyone who says that, are, are, you know... Those types of people, I think, sometimes natural selection just needs to take its place. I, I I could probably leverage that the people who deep fry hair ties and eat them as a trend in South Korea, which, by the way, is real. It, it I probably have a little more intelligence than those people, but yeah. Uh, so I mean, look, it's not genocide. Now there are things you can criticize Israel of. Which are absolutely true. Like the white phosphorus bombings in 09 and uh, 2010, roughly. I think between 08 and uh, 2010, roughly. I, I have to relook up that information. But I know for a fact there was white phosphorus bombings in uh, civilian centers, which is not allowed. Like, that's, you know what I mean? And I think Israel even recognized that they did that, and it was probably not allowed, so they, so they disarmed it. 
but still the fact it happened, right? But, uh, yeah, so, I mean, again, there's things you can criticize them about, but genocide is the dumbest fucking imaginable argument you can make, you know, but a lot, a lot of these people are just dumb and dumber, so they'll, they'll just continue to follow dumber, because they're dumb, so, I mean, yeah, like, at the end of the day, Israel's not committing genocide, they're not, I'm sorry, you, you could, you could make an argument, maybe, to, like, things they've done in the past, or whatnot, but at the end of the day, I don't know why you think you could kill 10% of a country's population and expect them not to fire off on all cylinders on everything to have to mop the floor with you. Like, I'm sorry, I, I don't know why you would, ex like, how you would expect Israel not to do what they're doing. Anyone with half a brain cell could realize that, or is not a hebophile, you know? Uh, but but the, I guess that makes sense, you know? Someone who thinks that having sex with minors because they had a puber had their puberty is fully ex should be acceptable. Probably should just be bombed to smithereens, I'm not gonna lie to you. Um, but yeah, uh, yeah, but, uh, that's pretty much it, you know? And, uh, don't tell the Muslims that this was secretly Aisha, Muhammad's wife. You know, don't tell them that though. Anyways, like I said, if you like the video, like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell notification on. That way, uh, you guys get all of my content and all these things because I'm tired of the Hamas sympathy. Like, it's just absolutely absurd to me the legs people will go to justify their own thoughts. But anyways, again, peace.